Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a while. Um, I think the last video I made was in November 1st-ish. And then I got sick. And just the timing, I was super busy in November, so I didn't get a chance to make a video. So today I am reviewing the last six months of my planner to see what I've used, what I've liked. Um, so that way going forward for the next six months, I can determine what I really do use and what really helps me be productive. So I have the Life Planner from Erin Condren, um, the seven by nine with this braided of beauty with my name. Um, so I did use this occasionally. I marked when my um, um, children had school and stuff and I have this key over here. So I did use this. I did look at this occasionally through the school year. Um, I didn't really use this page. Um, these were projects that we were wanting to do. We haven't started any of them so that they're still um, viable. These are lists of things that I wanted to buy or read or watch or I needed. Um, so I haven't really added anything to it in a while. And then here's my act home activities on like what I needed to be doing house chores why each day. Um, we really, I stuck to the laundry schedule for like three months. But then after that, I just was like, whenever we got it in. So, um, then this was July and I was using this for my book project. Um, this is a timeline of the plot points and then these are just um, things that I wanted to accomplish. So, I don't think I didn't really accomplish anything on my book project until November. So, um, I love the monthly spread, um, putting bills and when people are gone and like I was putting receipts on how much I bought. I stopped doing that, but I really liked doing that. So I think I'm going to start doing that again. And then I didn't get it until here. So I did use it here. I used it, um, used it here and then, so this is August. Again, I did this timeline and I put some goals. I met my goal in August of getting to my word count. Um, I bought several things here that I used. Oh, I really used it here. So a good solid four weeks I was using it. Um, I did it again September. Um, I did accomplish some of my book goals here. And so I have September monthly. And so I'm still using my planner here. And then I start not using it. It's just, you can see there's not very much written here. Oh, this week I was all for it. It's super cute, that's probably why. And then this was super cute, so I did some of this. And then October, I kinda did this. Um, I had some goals. Looks like I met three of the four goals I did for October. And then I did um, the monthly. I wrote some things, but didn't really. And then I did some here, and some here, and some here. And then November, I was doing um, NaNoWriMo. And so I made this to work with it, but I did not use it at all. I did meet my 50,000 word goal, 
and I only missed one day of writing so I did fairly well on that um, my monthly I have marked off I really use this monthly I look at it a lot um, so the first week I used it second week I um, kind of used it third week I used it if you can believe that in November we had a snow day that's just crazy uh, so I oh I switched how so like this I was just using for personal with to do list and then this week I divided it up to have work stuff and personal and I did that for two weeks here and then December I sort of made this cute but I didn't write anything on it did do the monthly for December and I started with the work in the personal and it just kind of dwindles down to where I like, didn't use anything the last couple weeks here so we're on this week here and I didn't write anything this is super super cute pattern here but I definitely didn't use any of it um, so the only other thing planner that I got um, to work with was the budget book and I used about two months of the whole thing and then I just started using it as a transaction along so I think going forward that's all I'm going to be using it for and I do have the debt tracker in the back that I was using so I did do that um, but I think going forward I'm only going to do the transaction log in this because I've been keeping um, the other pieces I have budget in this life planner um, just like a, a calculation of a total so but yeah so that's I didn't do too bad on using my planner every day but I definitely think um, I could do it more so um, if you like this video give it a thumbs up I think that's gonna be it for me now today I um, just wanted to walk through how I did how I did in the planner the last six months um, try to see you know why I mean there were some weeks that I didn't take this with me everywhere it doesn't fit in the purse that I use all the time so I think for the next six months I'm gonna try to use see about getting a different system in place um, but thanks for watching bye